Okay guys, do you know what is this? So this is actually a, a water pump or submersible water pump. It may be these are so many applications used at uh, 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 aquarium water pumps and uh, to uh, circulate the water to the messes. So actually this is not like this. The actual construction is like this. Uh, but I remove all the casing of this pump and because only these I have need so the other one of the extra weight for this generator so this is actually a magnet and this one is the core and windings are placed in that inside this casing and so by doing this simple generator it doesn't need any other components or copper wires to run the core and windings nothing we just need only these two we can make and another one is the motor dc motor so the the construction is very simple we have to just make shaft this to the magnet and fix like this and put into the core okay It's glowing very bright and very bright and turn off the lights oh it is very good but time scared to touch it because it may be get shock at any call wow how yeah, this is the illuminance or get by this motor see wow it illuminated my overall room here A simple generator but it produces so much of 
power good lighting okay guys this is now load checking time and how much load that the other uh, the, the generator was bare and okay here is the three ten watts bulb so total is 30 watt and this one is the plug box connected parallelly to the three bulbs and there is nothing in this box just connections why connections okay so so this is our generator and this one is the 12 volts adapter and this 12 volt supply is given to this motor and output of this generator is given to this socket and this socket directly connects the bulbs in parallel okay okay now i connect this output of the generator to the socket and socket is connected parallel to the bulbs and uh, okay two bulbs so only one bulb is connected to it and okay wow you see the how much illuminance of light it is very good and efficient but uh, and and i connect another bulb so 10 plus 10 so 20 watt here yeah there is no drop it's working very good and next another 10 watt yeah there is no drop i think i can easily handle the 30 watt Mm-hmm.